Hello. In Mahapatran's form today, we discuss a small trivia. When I was posted in USA and UK, my American friends and English friends used to tell me that whenever you have a cold, you must take brandy or cognac with hot water. Many times I obliged them and I experimented with it and I found quite a relief. So today when I had a cold, I remembered this old adage, but this time I thought that I will make a little bit of research to find out whether there is any truth in it and how cognac is the remedy that has come to be prescribed for cold. Now using brandy or cognac mixed with hot water is a home remedy traditionally practiced for ages and centuries. But the perceived efficacy is yet to be proven scientifically. So what could be the reasons for which this has come to be regarded as a home remedy like many other home remedy, home remedies. These are, you know, providers of symptomatic relief of the most painful aspects of an ailment. For example, if you have a sore leg, you put it in warm water so blood starts flowing and as a result the muscles get relaxed. Similarly, when you take brandy or cognac with hot water when you are having a cold, it provides you warmth and comfort and the hot water warmth provides you a soothing and some of the symptoms of cold gets relieved which could be a sore throat or it could be a congestion in your nose leading to breathing difficulty. Similarly, the effect of alcohol, which is there in the brandy, it provides a little bit of relaxation. It can induce sleep and sleep is known as the best remedy for cold. Even in case of paracetamol as a symptomatic relief, it induces sleep. As a result, you feel relaxed. The third important factor why cognac or brandy with hot water provides some relief is the hydration effect while hot water aids hydration alcoholic is typically a diuretic and can lead to dehydration if consumed in large quantities however it is important to balance this very small quantity so that you get the relaxation but as i told there is always a risk of alcohol abuse and as a result, it is always recommended that alcohol is avoided and when you are combining with some types of medicine and if it is not taken after consulting a doctor could lead to problems like over dosage, oversleeping, over drowsiness, etc. The curative property is not medically proven, but as we have just discussed, there are a large number of evidence that it provides relaxation and hydration combined with warmth which leads to relieving the symptoms of cold. In parting, I must tell you a little bit about cognac. Cognac is known to be an upper class drink, typically a refined brand of brandy and it is produced in a small region of southwestern France, which is around the towns of Cognac and Angoulême. The region has uh, six zones, Grand Champagne, Petite Champagne, Borderies, etc. is not relevant for this, but a typical type of grapes, which is high in acidity and low in alcohol content, is produced in the Cognac producing effect and the primary grape is known as uni black and the uses of cognac includes as a drink which is sipped with very little water either neat or on the rocks and it is mixed in cocktails where it forms of many basic classic cocktails such as sidecar french 75 Brandy Alexander. 
Interestingly, it is the base of uh, many French recipes. So culinary uses of uh, cognac is very very high, and the sauces, the stews, and the desserts are always studded with different vari varieties of cognac, which has been matured over a period of time. Traditionally, cognac is also used for uh, uh, a different purpose, not for cold, as a tonic for post-dinner digestive problems. So, its specific production, its high class uh, categorization and its medicinal properties along with culinary uses makes cognac an interesting drink but as they always see, is always better to avoid alcohol and whenever you want to use it as a medicine, do consult your doctor. Thank you very much.